today I'm going to be doing a video on my favorite self tanner. Um, this is the Sun Labs self tanner. I'm sure a lot of you have already heard of this. I have talked about this countless times. I love this stuff. Mine's in dark. I know I don't look super tan, but the lighting is like right here. This stuff works like you put it on and you're tan the next day. And I've tried a million and one self tanners that say they're gonna do that and they build up gradually and then they look orange. This does not look orange, it looks brown. Um, it's very natural looking and it works. So um, it's a little higher end, I would say on the website like $40. This I got off Amazon and it was $20. So I highly recommend going on Amazon because it's not worth paying $20 extra when you don't have to. This stuff is a lotion. It's a dark brown color. That's what it looks like. So you can see that it's very, very, very dark. Um, and when you apply it, the color guard will show up. So it's like a brown color and you can see where you're putting it. And that will wash off when you take a shower, but the tan will stay. It might seem like the tan is washing away, but it's actually just the color guard. So don't freak out if that happens. This has a green undertone to it, so it's not going to be orange. Um, or like red. It's a very, very, very nice color. How I apply this, I usually use a mitt. Look at how gross that is. I've used this a lot. I need to get a new one. You can get these at Ulta or a Sephora. Um, they're like six dollars, I think. Like take the lotion and then you just rub it in. So it's actually really easy to put on if you have that mitt. Otherwise, you could use your hands, but you might want to wash them like immediately after because it will stain your hands like a tan tanny color and it's not cute so I do recommend getting the glove um, for any self tanner it's really easy to use and you don't get it all over yourself the bottle itself has lasted me like six months or more and it's only I think it's only like halfway full the tan lasts about a week and then you can reapply or um, if you put on moisturizer you'll also prolong the life of your tan so I recommend doing that but I do highly 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 recommend this um, it is like the best self tanner I've ever used I've never tried the Saint Tropez but I have tried a million and one drugstore ones and I've tried a couple high-end ones I do like the fake bake but I don't think it lasts as long so I do like this and I did a little demo which I will be showing right here so first you're going to need a lotion, your self tanner, and a mitt. You're going to start off with your lotion, putting it on the rough spots such as your knees, your ankles, and your toes. Now you take your mitt, about two pumps on your thigh. Rub it in really good. And after that's all rubbed in, you can do two pumps on your calf and rub that in as well. Right here you can tell the color guard is on my left leg. This is day two. As you can tell, my legs are a lot more tan and even looking. And I know I don't look super tan afterwards, but if you looked at the before, my legs were really, really pale. I filmed the demo a little while ago when I was more pale, so you could see that it does give you some color even if you're pale. I would recommend doing probably a few applications of the self-tanner, probably like two to three if you really wanted to get dark. If you're my skin tone now, um, you'd probably only need one. It's the most pretty natural tan ever. Fall is coming, winter's coming. Everyone's looking for a good self tanner and I'm telling you this is my holy grail self tanner. And I'm not even sponsored by them, I just love them. So I was not sent this, I bought this with my own money and I am obsessed with it. So good job Sun Labs. But I hope you guys enjoyed my video and I will see you in the next one.